Why? Uh, I, I heard you were sick. Oh, right. Yeah. Oh, well, let me just clean up in here a little bit. Game? It's just people standing around answering questions? Well, there'll be women in bikinis holding up the scores. Let's play bamboozle! Uh, I better go. No, wait, wait, wait. Oh, please, hold, hold it up so I can listen. What we did last night was... Stupid. <laughs> Twice! Get this uncontrollable need to please people! <laughs> fine, fine. You would not hold up well under torture. Oh, and you would? I did. In English phrasal verbs, we will learn the verb, hold up. It means one. To hold someone or something up in the air. Examples, she held the $100 bill up to the light to make sure it was real. Hold your hands up high and jump to catch the ball. Two. When you stop slash delay someone or something for a moment. Examples, we've reached capacity, so we need to hold up the line until some people leave. The rain held up long enough for us to get inside. 3. When you steal from a person or business by threat of violence. Examples, the bank robbers held up three banks in one week. An unidentified man held up the grocery store for cat food. 4. To remain in a physically slash emotionally strong or stable condition. Examples, Sheila is holding up pretty well despite her recent divorce. I hope my car holds up until I can afford to get it fixed next week. Now, let's see how hold up is used in real life. But I held up my end of the bargain. You better hold up yours. Not pretty? No, you hold up, okay? But this path you're on, flip. You should also play bridge, hold up a hoopah, and enter the Olympic bobsled competition. <laughs> uh, tickets to that, please. If I can get under his skin in less than an hour, how do you think he'll hold up under the press? It'll be a turkey shoot. It'll hold up just fine. We'll see. <laughs> Fine, fine. You would not hold up well under torture. Oh, and you would? I did. You held something back because you knew what we were up to. The question is, why'd you let us in at all? An audition. Years. Which means your vow of silence won't hold up in court. So here's a new deal. Testify against Hiram. Apology, now get out. Oh, wonderful. Now, would you mind holding up this shirt while I... Get... <laughs> Take the test at accent101.com to find out... Si sabes inglés o hablas inglés.